You are about to listen to an exclusive interview on Maximum Threshold Radio. Thanks for listening to us at MaximumThreshold.net. Horns up, fists in the air. This is Michael with Chris from Motionless and White. How you doing? I'm fantastic, man. I'm very excited to play today. You don't, you don't look like the kind of guy that gets out in the sun too much. I uh, no, I, I try to keep the pale complexion all over yeah, at all times. Avoiding that, avoiding that melanoma, right? Yeah. <laughs> or, or are you a vampire? No, I just uh, I, I wear a lot of uh, a lot of girly makeup. So. A lot of what? A, a lot of makeup. It's just a front. Are you? Are you? Do you hate yourself? Is that why you wear makeup? No, no, no. I just uh, I have a certain uh, certain interest in a certain look that I like to accomplish. That's that. cool. I'm yeah. busting balls. Right? Uh, so good. tell us yeah. tell us a little bit about Motionless and White. Uh, we are a metal band from Scranton, Pennsylvania. Uh, rest in peace, The Office. Sorry. Um, just trying to move our band in a direction to kind of keep doing these awesome things like rocking the range a lot more with our career so things are going well cool so um let us tell everybody who's going to be listening where we can find your music uh buy your merchandise and find out tour dates and any other kind of info about motionless and white got it uh i feel like most people today find music on youtube more than anywhere else so you could uh, go on youtube just type our name in or uh we have merch at merchnow.com and tour dates on like the typical Facebook, Twitter type social media places. So just anywhere on the internet, type it in on Google and you're good to go. Cool, cool. So what do you? How do you feel about um, people just taking your music online? Do, does it bother you, or do you just happy to get out there? Yeah, I, it doesn't bother me anymore. I'm so used to the fact that that's how music works these days. Uh, I'd rather somebody have our record and have our music and come to a show than never hear us at all because they didn't have the money to buy the record. So I'm all for it, man. It sucks that it does hurt bands, but it's all, it's, I'd rather you know have a fan than nobody at all. Well, so uh, what do you do in the band? I sing. You sing? Yep. Do you, do you have any interest in maybe joining Man of War and donning the, um, the loincloth? I will pass on that. What about, would you join Devo? Uh, if if I got to customize my red spirally hat that they wear, you'd have to make it black, right? Yeah, for sure. Yeah, I, I can't guess. do. I can't. You can't do wear the yellow jumpsuit either, right? <laughs> no. Hey, do you only wear black because there's no color darker? That is 100 percent correct. So what what were your? <laughs> I feel like we're in an episode of Metalocalypse right now. So what um what uh bands influenced you personally? Uh, definitely bands as early as the Misfits, uh, that they're a huge band for me. Uh, metal bands like Pantera, Metallica, that's what got me into wanting to play music in the beginning. So, uh, yeah, those are like my earliest influences, Metallica, Pantera, Misfits, uh, yeah. So the, the, your, the look doesn't necessarily bel- belie the style of music? No, I mean, our, our style of music, yeah, they kind of go hand in hand, but my influences and uh, my own personal interests, not necessarily. I mean, I have, a, I have a very wide range of interests in music, so, yeah. But did your mom, like, bitch about all your tattoos? Oh, yes, she did. I got, I got a Jewish mother that used to complain about mine, and she just gave up. That's pretty much where I, where I went. I just kept doing it until she just shut the hell up about it. Okay, so, so you decided you might as well stay out of the sun because you don't want to fade your colors, uh, right? That's true. Totally it. One hundred. It's not because of no. the, the goth look. It has nothing to do with that. It's just the tattoos. Cool. Cool. Is there? Is there? Um, I know there's a lot of people probably waiting around, and I know you guys got about about an hour or two yeah. to the stage time, so I won't take much more of your time. Chris, I'd like to thank you from Motionless and White. You want to throw out your website and stuff again, real quick? Yeah, that would be uh, motionlessandwhite.net and, or just merchnow.com/motionlessandwhite to find some music and merch and whatnot. Thank you, Chris. Thanks for having me, man. You have just listened to an exclusive interview on Maximum Threshold Radio. Thanks for listening and please visit us at MaximumThreshold.net.